Kate, new tonight at 10. We are introducing you to K9 Athos, the newest member of the Hollywood Police Department. Way 31's Sarah Singletary met the K9 officer and his handler today and learned where he will be used the most. He's a good boy. K9 Athos touched down in Hollywood just two weeks ago. Nose. Nose? It means for him to heal. K9 Handler and Police Chief Jason Hepler has to give Athos his commands in check because that's the language the K9 was trained in. Boost. Boost. The two met earlier this month for a two week training session at a special K9 facility in Texas. It takes a while to put that bond together. The dog doesn't necessarily respect you as soon as you show up there. Athos is the department's third K9 officer and is stepping in for K9 Fox, who's retiring. Come here. Boost. Hepler said they've had a strong canine unit since it started in 2011. Our canine unit's actually been very successful here. Um, we've seized hundreds of pounds of drugs off the highway. Hepler said the department's canine officers do most of their work along Highway 72, which he described as a drug corridor. Good. But they're also trained to bite. We use canines for officer protection. We use them for um, apprehension. And we use them for if there's ever a situation where we need crowd control. Chief Hepler let me try on the bite suit, and in just a second, he's going to gently let K9 Athos go and show you guys what it looks like when he gets someone on the arm. All right, Chief, let's do it. Sure. <laughs> Without this protective jacket, my arm would be his chew toy. And even with the jacket, it's clear these powerful jaws are not something you want to tangle with. Hepler said Athos is still getting acclimated to this new environment, but he's already out working the streets. In Hollywood, Sarah Singletary, Way 31 News. Mm, Sarah's brave. Well, the chief told us a town the size of Hollywood wouldn't be able to afford a canine without the grant from the Canines for Cops organization.